um, this facility, Richmond Hill Hatchery, is unique in that um, we produce uh, striped bass, which produce several things in the spring. We have a lot, one of the largest hatcheries in the southeast, one of the newest hatcheries in the southeast, and we produce um, largemouth bass, hybrid striped bass, striped bass, um, bluegill catfish, and and right now this is this facility is the only place in the state that produces stripers um, and hybrid striped bass fry, and then we distribute those uh, to other hatcheries. So that's what we're doing now is, is our annual fry production. We make about rough numbers, about six million reciprocal hybrids, which is a white bass female crossed with a striped bass male. Say we get 100, 200 fish, we'll inject those um, with hormone uh, the next morning and it's very very precise on timing on injection and water t and water temperature the two main things that drive all this but we inject them at a time such that we can come back the next day it takes about 24 to 30 hours for the hormone to to act on those females and the males um, and we come in and we start checking through the batch of fish that were injected and we start getting it's it's a bell curve. You start you get a few, and then you come back three hours later. You run through them again, and so as we get these and they're ripe, we'll we'll put carefully dry the fish off, put the eggs in a bowl. Um, same thing with the male. We'll weigh the eggs, and then we'll add the sperm, and then at that point we'll add water, and that activates the sperm and causes fertilization process to happen. So there's a there's a process of uh, water hardening in the presence of sperm and then and then those eggs are poured into McDonald jars where there's a certain concentration of tannic acid solution in that jar and from that point they roll in McDonald jars for uh, for a couple days and then they hatch and they swim up and out of that jar into the aquarium and from there we will keep them for about five or six days and then we uh, and then we stock them in these ponds that you see all around us.